have a letter from Bishop Philip Wright uh, on Anglican Diocese of Belize stationery, but writing on behalf of both the Belize Council of Churches and the Evangelical Association as a follow-up to our conversation, the conversation between uh, himself and, and, and myself, regarding the support of your administration for the construction of an ecumenical chapel on the grounds of the Carl Houston Memorial Hospital in Belize City. That's a consummation devoutly to be wished. The government will finance the entirety of the construction out of Petro Caribe funds. The churches voted against the loan motion when it went to the Senate. And now you are building a church, uh, a chapel. <laughs> Is that that you are trying to bring them around through the use of your no, sir. I was told, I was told by two of the leaders with whom I spoke that that vote was not a vote that came after discussion uh, with the officials, Pastor Longsworth is right here, and was certainly then not a vote upon the instruction of the churches. That seems to have been an individual vote on the part of Father Leslie. Okay, so you we, we had been talking about the chapel well before the vote. I just wanted to be sure, indeed, because of Father Leslie's vote, that we were still on, because I asked the same question. It was made clear nobody gave Father Lester that instruction. Um, and the churches, uh, those that have no difficulty with government funding the chapel, as had always been the plan. Um, well, I hadn't said I would fund it. I said I would have contributed. It's not a great deal. It's a hundred and twenty-five or hundred and fifty thousand dollars So uh, I just wanted to be sure there was no problem with funding it. I, I, and that there will be full disclosure that repeat that that's where the money would be coming.